these days of agitators, isms, schisms, and dictators, when one never knows whom one is talking to, when we've princes picking winners and we've plumbers at golf dinners, it's so difficult to really say who's who. Even at our rugby dances, one's beset by vulgar glances and our finer sensibilities are shocked. Upon my soul, I'm not romancing. We are more danced against than dancing. And the flappers come and tell you they're half cocked. So thank heaven we are living in Rathgar. Oh, the solid, quiet refinement of Rathgar. Where we have our evening dinners, where we never hear of shinners, and even those who can't afford it have a car. There are some quite decent suburbs, I am sure. Oh, Rath Mines is not so bad or Terenure. Oh, we've heard of spots like Inchicore, but I really don't know where they are. For thank heavens we are living in Rathgar. Someone must live in Kilmainham, so it's hardly fair to blame them. And in Dartry they are almost civilised. But in Fairview, goodness gracious, fellows tennis in their braces. In Drumcondra, all their shirts are cubanized. Although it's worth relating, it's really devastating. At Ben Doyle, I saw my butcher in the ring. What with cinemas unsightly, and the gaiety gone twice nightly, it's no wonder that we are proudly forced to sing. That, thank heavens, we are living in Rathgar. But the solid, quiet refinement of Rathgar. In Kilester they eat cockles, and those fearful things, pig's knuckles. But you never heard of pipe in Crowner Square. Oh, those accents on the north side quite appalled. But they never get beyond Rath Mines Town Hall. They've so many kids in Kimmage that they say life's just a scrimmage. Oh, I'm tired. I'm going to the battery to have one. So thank heavens we are living in Rathgar. <laughs>